while home buyers are having to jump through hurdles and the amount of homes it's on the decline that are on the market. That struggle highlighted with the median price of an existing home selling last month for near record highs. Realtors say that's another detriment to the ailing market with such a short supply. With home sales on the decline as supply is stunted, a recent report from the National Association of Realtors shows in June the median price of an existing home on the market was $410,200. It's the second highest price ever recorded. Have the builders slowed down due to how expensive it is to build? Yes. But Realtor Tyler Kreiss tells me no one builds spec homes on land enticing buyers to them, which is a huge part of this problem. Supply just isn't being built fast enough at a price point people can afford. There are some inventory available, but yes, you are correct. In the majority of them, you do need to go under contract first, and then they're going to build. Homes are down more than 13% year over year with certain groups not able to put enough away for a down payment on specific price points. The biggest price point that I've seen struggling is the 400 to 600 range, right? It is, hey, we're middle class, we're making good, good income, probably two income households. We've got kids and those mortgage rates are higher than what we can rent for. Christ doesn't expect certain segments to come up for air for a while as interest rates are expected to remain high in the near future. He advises people looking to buy a home to match with a financial advisor and lender that look at your specific needs. Talking with a lender, talking with a financial advisor to get that down payment. Well, he also adds any homes falling into the $350,000 category are off the market within days if you can even find them. Of course, he says it's the same for homes over 600,000 where families at that threshold aren't really affected by the interest rates we're seeing.